what is up everyone for today in this video I'm gonna be wrapping the interior trim pieces on the BMW E46 um originally it had the wood grain and it was all cracked so what I decided was instead of replacing the entire trim piece kit for this car which is around three to four hundred dollars what I decided was let me try see if I can sand it all down put a couple coats of primer and then wrap it and then see if it turned out pretty well alright guys just to give you guys a quick update so I removed all the interior trim pieces on this car um, if you guys want a video on how to do that um, let me know in the comments below I'll show you guys on how to do that so I remove almost everything on this car uh, what I did was so all of these were wood grain trim pieces and um, I don't know if you guys were aware but all these trim pieces had like so many cracks inside of them so what I wanted to do was I didn't want to spend another 300 to 400 dollars on replacing all with genuine BMW trim pieces so what I decided was, let me try sanding it down and putting a couple of coats of primers and see if I can wrap it. So to give you guys a quick update, we sanded this down with 600 grit sandpaper and then on all of these. And then what we did was we put five coats of primer on all of them. And after that, we're good, I'm letting it dry and sanding it down with 2000 grit to make it fine and smooth. And then tomorrow, or tonight, when I get back, I'm going to try to see if I can wrap it. And that way, I can save a little bit of extra money to make it look better. So, stay tuned, and let's see how it turns out. Okay, guys, so to give you a new update on the trim pieces. So, um, as I showed you guys, I primed, I sanded all of the trim pieces down. I primed it, sanded it down again, and now I finally wrapped it. So, this is a brush, uh, brush silver aluminum. Um, I wrapped the entire car, entire trim piece with this color. Um, I really like it, and then so hopefully it turns out really. It turned out really good actually. Um, another thing is I ordered um, new pad, new upper armrests for this car. The ones that were originally on the car, they were all torn up. They were shredded in pieces. So bought and used one of those. Um, overall, on the new look, I actually like this a lot. Uh, comment, below, comment down below, let me know what y'all think, um, and later today I'm going to be popping these back into the car. I'll show you how they look. Alright, see you guys. Just to give you a quick idea, this is a new interior trim piece on the car. It is brushed aluminum, and I got new padding as well. That original padding was pretty, pretty torn up, and now this actually has a sweet new look to it. And then towards the center, like the, the new, where the shift knob is, all of that's like redone everything so I've saved three to four hundred dollars on this project and it turned out really well so comment below let me know what y'all think it looks good Kayla, Kayla what do you think I, I like it I like it um, I think it goes really well because it matches the silver of the car but it adds that contrast because it's the brushed effect that's what we did down the inside of um, the inside of my Audi which we'll have to throw some updates we haven't done anything recently with that so I'll, I'll later throw some pictures out but yeah, it looks really nice. I think it turned out really well. Alright, so that's basically it for this video, guys. Please share, subscribe, and like, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. See you guys. Peace.